What's up guys, Louis Galt. Welcome back to the channel. Again, we are jumping back in to the KV Core series, uh, one of the most phenomenal CRMs on the planet. And you get it free with our brokerage, which is awesome. But we are gonna jump in. I'm gonna show you how the squeeze page I made got me 27 qualified leads. So let's go ahead, jump into the computer and I'll show you what's up. All right, so we are in KV Core. What you're gonna do is you're gonna come down to Lead Engine, and then we're gonna to go to Build a Squeeze Page. So a squeeze page is pretty much gonna take um, whoever clicks on the link to a, um, a certain point, get them to put on in their information, and then from there it'll uh, go right into your CRM and you can you're able to work that lead. So uh, what you wanna do when you're in here is go to Seller Squeeze. And it's pretty simple and self-explanatory. Source, this just keeps um, kind of a track of where the leads come from. So you can kind of be like, okay, where are all the people I did from the Facebook post on this? So I'm gonna say Facebook um, seller uh, value post, whatever. And then hashtag, we're gonna do Facebook seller post. So whenever anyone who clicks on this um, link or fills in the information, it'll automate, automatically put that hashtag in front of it so you can easily search for them. And then location, I'm gonna search for Denver right here. And then that's it, you go generate link, boom. And it gives you a short one and a long one. And I'll just show you what that looks like. So copy the clipboard. If I come up and paste that, then that brings us to this squeeze page and this is exactly what it looks like. So this is Denver in the background and all that good stuff. Now, all they have to do is go ahead and put in their address and it will take them to it. So let's go ahead, I'll put in my address here, stick that there. You can put in the unit, get estimate, click. And it takes them straight to this page here. Now. I've already done this, so it has my information, <clears throat> but what it does is it pops up and it says enter your email and phone number um, to get this information. So uh, I already did this earlier uh, just for a demo for someone. So it already has my kind of fake person in there. So what it does, it pops up and it says, okay, um, generated to get this in their email and they put in their email and their phone number and then it brings them to this page and they can download the report they can get an email to them text to them or they can view comps on the property and while i clicked that i actually got an email uh, in my inbox which i'll switch over to and that tells me that uh, this person right here and that tells me that this person right here has gone ahead and submitted a home estimate and that they are now inside of my KV Core. And I'll jump back into my KV Core and let's go to Smart CRM. Actually, let's go to the dashboard and the dashboard will tell me, hey, this person here has done a home evaluation and they are already inside of my KV Core, which is awesome. Now, let me show you actually how I did this. So what I did was I copied the link just the way it was there. So I copied the link and on my Facebook page, my personal Facebook page, not your business one, do it on your personal. Um, all I said was, ever wondered how your home is worth, uh, ever wondered what your home is worth with everything going on these days in the housing market? Check out this new tool on my website. And then they click that and they go. So, you know, I've got 10 comments, a couple of people saying different things, which is great. But the real thing I care about is clicks. How many people actually clicked on it? So I'll show you just for proof here. This was my KV Core from um, this morning. So it tells me what happened yesterday. 27 new leads. These are all from that one Facebook post. So some of them are just addresses and some of them are names of people who put their names in. But the nice thing is, if it just has the address, you can just go into the MLS, look up that address, look up the owners and put them into your CRM. And now they are there. So that is how I got 27 leads from that one post. They just jumped in there and all of a sudden, I, I honestly wasn't expecting it. I was just testing it and it went bung, 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 bung. Everyone just started clicking on it which is really cool. Now, how do we follow up with these people? That is the thing. They all want evaluations. So they all want to know exactly what their home is worth. They don't trust the estimate anymore. So they want a good value. So what we are going to do is we're going to put them on to a market report now. So 
So I'm going to type in <clears throat> my guy here and find him and I'll show you what to do next. So you might have some drip campaigns built out. If you do have drip campaigns, then that's awesome uh, for sellers. But really um, what you should be doing uh, initially is obviously if they're coming from your sphere, which is Facebook, add them in there and then put the hashtags in uh, Facebook, different things like that. But I like to put them on market reports. And what you would do, add this in, and I would search on the zip code. So if they're in my zip code, 80238, and you can send them to this. I would say do it once a month to start with. You don't want to send a, a market report every seven days. That's a little bit aggressive. But I would just add this in. Market report every um, uh, month is going to send that over and that's going to be awesome. So um, that's going to set them up market reports and then you can add in, obviously, if you have active campaigns, like for me, I would put them on to a uh, either seller didn't commit or a seller uh, planning on selling in six to 12 months, I would probably set them on that one and that would set me up on that plan as well. That would just remind me to start calling them and do different things like that. So there you go. So that's how we did it. Very, very straightforward. Nothing really major or big. We did just very, very simple stuff and we just got people to click. So do that exact thing. If you're trying to build up your pipeline, build up your sphere, your database, put that in there. Everyone wants to know what their home is worth. And the nice thing is now you have their information. They enter that in there. You can use it for purposes of marketing and reaching out to people. You want to maybe want to get in touch with them like once a month, whatever, set them up on market reports and go from there. And that is how you're going to start slowly but surely getting into the listing part of the business, which is awesome. So there you have it. If you like what you see, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. That'd be awesome. You can like it and you can drop a comment below. That would be awesome too. Let me know if you have anything, if you have any questions, if there's any other things on KV Core that you want to know that you don't know how to do, reach out and I will do a video on that too. Until the next time, see ya.